And we're back with some more let's play or let's learn the Hearthstone Arena. So in the last couple of parts I created this kind of beast Helen deck, just no Consecrates, no Hammer of Wrath, but at least I have a true Super Champion. And I have two Legendaries, I have 3 and 0 with it, and hopefully we can keep on this win streak. Also, I said earlier that Dragon Consort's kind of useless, since the next dragon you play costs 2 less. And I said there's, I have no dragons, but that's a lie, I have Onyxia, which means Onyxia will cost 7 if I play this. Which is freaking great, I never thought of that, but then after I finished recording the second episode, I was I just thought of it. I was like, oh yeah, Onyxia is a dragon. So we could have some cool cool synergy there. I just I haven't ne I don't think I've ever played Dragon Consorts uh, yet, so yeah. Also I hope you guys are enjoying the these episodes. I certainly am. I'm I never I was hesitating to, in order uh, before starting this. I was hesitant. But I'm actually really enjoying it. I hopefully it's entertaining for you guys, as this for me. It's also better for me to play. Oh look, first another paladin. It's also better for me to play since I'm. Uh, I usually don't think as much about my plays as as I do now. But now since I have to talk through them, I'm thinking more. And I think I'm gonna keep the Cogmaster and the Argent Protector. I don't need the Food Doctor this, this early and the Dragon Consorts are also a late game card. Hopefully, we get another two drops so I can Argent Protector it. Oh no, we got our Force Tank. That's not, not never good. So, oh yeah, we have another mech, which will probably never synergize with Cogmaster, since it costs 8 mana. So, yeah. Let's see what he plays here. Probably nothing. Or in Zombie Chow, and make me sad. Um, it's probably the worst part of a Hearthstone, the wait in between battles. And tur turns on battles. Well, I have I have roped. In the last couple of games, I noticed that I roped a bunch of times. Oh, thank god we have a Divine Shield. We have, I mean, Shield is Minibot. So, yeah, we have Cogmaster plus Shield is Minibot. Um, I noticed that I roped a lot. Um, the past few the past few games, which I never used to do, which I apologize for my <laughs> opponents for doing that to them, since I hate that. But, you know, thinking usually, usually makes you rope, so... Kind of sucks. Um... That's probably Avenge. Is it Noble Sack or Avenge? It's either Noble Sacrifice, Avenge. Well, it could be anything. But I think it's Avenge though. No one really likes I Fire and I. Probably Avenge, cause they. You why did not turn one play that? I mean, I saw you played from like somewhere here. Do you have a one drop? That's mm. so weird. So let's check for Noble Sack. Oh, it's not Noble Sacrifice. Okay. So, like, I was right, it was probably Avenge. Okay, I could have I should have done attacked first, I mean, attacked second with this, doesn't matter with Noble Sack. So, that was a mistake. On my part. Since it doesn't matter, if, if I attack with the Cogmaster before or after Noble Sacrifice, sh I should have still have attacked after I put down the min Minibot. It's clobbering time, I sure. We could Coghammer. And then hit it with our face and hit it with this. But I think we prefer putting the Argent Protector onto it. Or or I could hit it, hit it, and then Argent Protector that. I think I prefer that. I prefer to have a 2-2 with Divine Shield. Hmm. Yeah, so I could I could hit it and hit it. Which which makes sense. I I draw oh wait. It's so weak to consecrate, that's my opinion that's my problem though, that with this. So I think I'd rather have the one minion with the fire shield than have two minions and no defined shield. So because it's so weak to consecrate. This might be incorrect, but I think I'll do that. Is it, it might be repentance as well, which would suck. Oh, it's not. So I'll just Arjun protector that. Because if I didn't do that previously, it would be so weak to consecrate, and he might have it, and it's around turn four, so it consecrate. And I think this would be better, since this survives the Consecration, so... Maybe I was right, maybe I wasn't. Okay, so just playing that... Hmm. Do I want to ignore it, is the thing. I think I would... I just draw a Gnomish, and then ignore it. He might buff it, that is the problem there. Hmm. So I could pr do this, and then it, it will give something Divine Shield and Taunt. You know what? I think I'll just I'll just force him to trade into me. 
and just draw a card. I will see where that goes. Because there's no way I can trade efficiently with that thing with, 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 besides using this call camera. And it's not efficient. I still have to trade in, which, eh. Glory to the oh god, that's terrible. What is with all these blood knights all of a sudden? Jeez. Oh, jeez. Oh my god. Another blood knight. Oh no, that has to die. I got blood knighted twice. Okay, that's probably the best the best place for it to go. Okay, so I could coin out Hogger, which doesn't make much sense. Wait, that's probably an Avenge. Oh, that's not good. That is probably awful if it's Avenge. Oh no. So, let's see. If that's Avenge, then it will give this or this plus two plus, plus like, three plus two, something like that. Yeah, plus three plus two. And then I could ho coin out Hogger and it would give it a taunt. No, that's not really a good idea. I think I'm gonna have to cog hammer. I think I'll cog hammer and hit that. And since that's that's probably a bench, right? Yes. Don't buff this, okay? Actually, it would have been able to buff this, because that I would have been able to get rid of it easier. I think I'll just pirate. I and then trade that into that and go face. Hmm. This is an awkward situation because Blood Knight is so annoying. What's with all the Blood Knights all of a sudden? Oh god, that's not good at all. Failing. I'm gonna have to take this damage to the face, aren't I? Because if I hug her here, it, it, it gives me a 2 2, and then what? This kills it, and then this trades into that, which is not great, and that's a 7 7. Now I could coin out Garden of Kings, which I think I will gonna have to do because I mean, at least it gives me a big dude. I'm definitely gonna kill this. This head definitely is gonna die. It sucks, but I have to take seven damage to the face. Um, I think I'm gonna coin out this. It's it's it sucks because it's free trades, which isn't great. It's just free trades into the Garden of K the Boulderface free trades into Garden of Kings. Uh. So what's my other option? Hoggering and the two two, which he probably put this into it, mm. and then trade this for that. Eh, I'll, I'm gonna do Guardian of Kings. Coin out Guardian. We'll see. That Blood Knight really screwed me over. You could have, you could argue that I should have just put both of the both of the divine shields into it. Oh, that's not not so good. I think this is losing. Yeah, this is definitely losing. Yeah, just go face. What else could I draw? I have no clear. This is a problem. Okay, you could silence something. Probably silence that, because that's annoying. But then what would I do? Then I could hit, and hit it to my face. Yeah, okay. I think I'll do that. Silence that save. thing. Wait, no. Here's a look. I think I'm dead anyway, so... For justice. I can't do that. Yeah, here's Lisa. That was well played. It was the stupid Blood Knight. The, that Blood Knight was so good. Oh god, I couldn't do anything about it. If I had drawn my silence earlier, maybe it would have done a difference, but I don't think I could have recovered off it at Blood Knight. That was so good. Oh god, that sucks. Well, that's our first loss. Um, I, could have, I don't think I could have played around the Blood Knight. I mean, who, who would have played around the Blood Knight there? It was so much value, that's, that sucks. Oh well, it was our first loss, it was bound to happen. Since this isn't that, I don't think it, w it is a 12-0 deck. But let's see, I, it, I think this is a 7-win deck though. Uther we'll see. Jane. Oh no, now first to face two okay-ish classes. And now we're facing, now we faced uh, two after each other, the two of the best classes. I think I'm gonna ship everything. Avenge is good to keep, but if I don't get a 2-drop here, it would suck. M major balls. Okay, good. I, I got a two, 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 two drops. And actually a good two drop. And Coghammer, cool. So we play this next turn. No point in recopulating, to be honest. Oh, that's good. Well, not really. No, at least this, this trades efficiently that, and then I force him to ping. So that's fine. I could have been greedy and hero powered, but he just ping it, so there's no point. This I, th I have to trade here. 
I have to force him to trade anyway. And if he doesn't trade, I can cold hammer. Oh, okay. Oh, okay, so he just... Okay. That's fine, it, he's still traded, and that's a, a, a naked direwolf. Unfortunately, I really have nothing to play here, so I'm just gonna hear power. And hope that he doesn't kill anything. This sucks, this is really bad. Uh, my hand is so weird. I have nothing to play for, not at least two turns. And he's probably gonna kill it. Yep, smart. This, this is bad. When your opponent plays a mini- oh, uh, oh well. Am I just really gonna put this down as a body? That's so stupid. I could put this and then define shield it. That that might work, and then kill the stupid, the stupid our uh, direwolf. But that's so bad. Mm. It's so weak. Ah, oh, I hate this. Hmm. I think I'm gonna have to though, because there's nothing I can do. Because if I kill the direwolf, at least he's forced to ping and still trade. So I think I'm gonna have to do that. Yeah, whatever. Just give you plus. Blah blah blah. That, that was a weird lag right there. Oh, that was bad. Oops. Oh my god. I gave it to that. The wrong thing. Oh my god. I'm so stupid. That was such a misplay. My bad. Oh my god. <sighs> See, these are the things I should be thinking about. The little things. And now he has that, which is awful. Which I, I should have played that, actually. Hmm. Okay. So, definitely gonna hear power here. Now the question is, do I want to trade? He'll ping it next turn. I think I'm going to. I have to. I think I'm just gonna hit it. Play the doctor. That's such an annoying minion and hit it. And then play repentance. If I played repentance last turn, it would have been fantastic. But I would not have this. I would not. I would not have been able to deal with that with anything. Mm. Let's see what he plays. Oh wow, that's actually really good for us. And he's gonna coin what? Coin time rewinder. Okay then, I guess he really wants to keep that. Then he'll probably go face. Hmm, do I want a Lord of the Arena or do I want a Hogger? I think I wanna play this since it trades efficiently to that and he has polymorph probably. So I'm just gonna play that. And he probably has a uh, polymorph though, which sucks. You know, take candle. Oh, jeez. That's so good. Oh, mages. I'm just getting the right answers. Okay, and face, so I can't hit that. Uh, do, am I, do I play Guardian of Kings here? Do I play on curve? I'm definitely gonna hit that and kill it. I do not want mages. It's stupid. What's stupid? What's called? Um. Spell powers. So now that showed me that it doesn't have uh, a polymorph, but still he might have a flame strike, which which would be bad for the hogger. So I think I'm just gonna play the Guardian of Kings here and hit him in the face one for one. Because if he has flame strike, hogger would be completely annihilated, which sucks. And then if he doesn't kill this, I can always recombobulate it. Hit, hit, and recombobulate. That's definitely gonna die. Everyone! Get in here! Oh, that's totally great. Oh, that sucks actually, because I can't hit with this stupid cog hammer. So, definitely gonna kill this. Fuck this thing. Screw it. Then I'm gonna recombobulate it. Oh, into another Garden of Kings. Okay, that makes sense. I guess. And then I'm gonna throw a card. Why not? Okay. Wow, that that was so weird. Jeez. But I never uh, seriously. What are the odds to recombobulate into the same card? Everyone, get in. 
Oh god, that is a terrible. Oh god. Oh god, don't kill anything. If you fucking kill this, I swear to Christ. Oh, thank god. Oh god. Oh, thank Christ. So, we ha we can we have the opportunity to kill this. Oh no, he's going to chain now. Oh, this is such an annoying guard. The fucking grip patron, man. Yeah, that's that's such a good idea, straight. Oh god. Mm, da -da -dum. So that this is seven damage, so I can kill that, but it's just so terrible to kill that. I can't play Hogger because it gives him free stuff. Oh my god, this is such a weird place to be in. It's 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 weird, but I think I want to play True Silver Champion just to kill one of them, and then kill kill one of them, and leave that alive. Do I want to? Let's let's Blessing of Kings this. I mean Blessing of Wisdom. And kill this. Oh, that's such a good draw! Oh, wow! Yeah, get fucked. Okay, you die. For justice. Kill that. Play this. Okay, that was good. That was such a that's a great draw. Good thing I did that. That was a great draw. It sucks that it trades in this trades in the green patron. Oh, but he's gonna ping that again. That's such an annoying card. Get in here. Okay, he's gonna draw cards. We're looking for a frame strike if he has it. Oh god, that's terrible. But at least I can choose a champion, this stupid thing. Oh, what is that? That is probably mirror entity. Uh, definitely true silver champion. And kill that stupid thing! It's pro that is definitely mirror entity. I'm not gonna play anything. And we'll see what happens. From here. Okay, Mono Worm. If he has spells, it would be great. It doesn't look like he does. Oh, Mech Warp, he's definitely dying. Oh, uh, what? Oh, I'm definitely I don't want to give him a Yeti. Oh, that's not good. Okay, so I could do this and kill it. No, do I, how do I do this? So I play this, he gets mirror entity, and then it die, and then it, it then he has one here. So I true silver champion this. Mm. I kill that and and then I trade that into that, which I think is really efficient and I can play Hogger. So let's check for mirror entity, which probably is. It's not. Holy whoa. Okay. It's not mirror entity. So let's play hogger then. Okay, that makes things much easier. So is it vaporize? It might be vaporize. So put this into this. This into that. And if it's if it's vaporize, if that dies. That's fine. Oh, ice barrier. Okay. Okay. I just was so sure it was Mirror Entity. For duty. Now I'm assuming he doesn't have Flame Strike. He has two cards, he hasn't used it he hasn't used it yet, and I'm assuming he doesn't have a flame strike. Hopefully he doesn't just top deck it now, which would suck. But you know, I still have a Yeti, which I could use. Okay, another secret, that's that's probably Mirror Entity. Unless he knows another ice barrier. That's really slow. I don't like that card. Oh and another mono worm, whoa. What that's really bad ordering. Why not? W wait, okay, so let's hit. Let's check for vaporizers. Oh, ice barrier. Another ice barrier, jeez. Okay. So let's hit here. And hit and hit. And then hit him. And then play everything. Play all the things. Since he can't get. Th he literally can't get through this because of that. Because of that Alder Peace Keeper. Unless he top decks a flame strike, I basically win. That that's mighty what he was waiting for. Another secret? What? Did you get another stupid like ice barrier? God, God. Why would you ping that? Oh, that that co why would that cost zero? Oh, that's because of the fairy dragon. Because of the stupid this. Oh God. Okay, let's check what for this. Okay, so that's probably mirror entity. Wait, that might be duplicate. Hmm, uh, that's a thing. So just go face. Okay. Uh. 
Nothing on the board could get through this. We're in a really good position. Yeah, yeah, well played. That was really good. Okay, that was fine. So now we're what? 5 0? 5 1? Okay, cool. We got the quest. That was really good. We got control on the board. We never really lost it. We're 4 0 now. I mean, 4 1. We got control on the board. We never really lost control of the board. And yeah, that was really fun. I mean, that was really great. Let's see if we can get to 7. My goal is to always get, hopefully, get to 7 so we can refund my, my gold. And continue playing arena for you guys. Okay, let's see. And if this really gets popular, I might ask you guys maybe it's for a straw poll or like on Twitter. We'll see about we'll see how popular this is. So do I wanna keep the voodoo doctor is a thing, is the thing. No, I think I'm gonna toss these two. I like voodoo doctor later when like trade and then I heal, I heal it. Yeah, this is fine. I can coin out a, a two drop. I'll probably coin out uh the the, the stone splinter. So let's coin out the stone splinter. Unfortunately, it doesn't trade into that, which sucks. I'm gonna have to use another thing. Does he tap here? Oh, he's gonna dark bomb. Okay. Yeah, we have another two drop, so it's fine. Um, the difference is with if I didn't coin out this, he could have just hit and dark bombed anyway. Mm, which I don't know. Does he have another dark bomb? Oh god, I hate that card. Such a good card, so annoying to deal with. So let's see. So that's really good. Uh, do I do I want to blessing of wisdom this and hit it? That might for no wait. Yeah, that might force him to trade. Cause I could yeah, one card for one mana is pretty fine. Oh, yeah, and we get Wild Pyro, so that's great. So just go ahead and play that. Now he has an option between tra to killing these two. If he has Hellfire, that's f that's great for him. But he'd probably want to kill this. This is also threatening. If I could get my Seal of Light, it would be also great, but I doubt I will. Yeah, I can play this. That's, that's trade into that. That's fine. Okay, so I could Acolyte. Now I could hit and then trade it, but that's, uh, that would give me, leave me with such a poor board. So I think I'm just gonna play the Deity and see where it goes. I, if I if I play this and hit that, then it would be a 3-1 versus a 2-1, and that comes back as a 2-1 anyway, which would make the board a bit weird. I could then the Eldoy Peacekeeper that and trade so that I don't lose this enough HP on this. We'll see. I do have two. I do have more than one, so we'll see. He's going face. Hmm. If he goes face, probably hit that and then true silver and that kill it. Oh god! Yes, bomber, I love you. Oh, oh, I'm sorry. Oh, that was so good for us and so bad for him. Oh my god. Please hit my face. That'll be fantastic. Oh god, yes. We just RNG'd so much. Oh, that that's terrible though. I, I hate that thing. Ah, uh, that was that was such good RNG. Okay. If I had a freaking spell, it would be so good, but I don't, unfortunately. So do I dragon consort and just hit and hit, which is, would be so bad if I did. But I'm gonna have to. So hit. I could true silver hit it and then. Uh... Hmm. I think I'm gonna true silver hit that. That that's definitely gonna happen. Now if I hit this and hit this, that's a four four, and his stats to give both into these. Okay. Okay. So hit that. Hit that, and then true silver that. We also have a, a, a significant card advantage. He has three cards. I have four, and he, if he taps, that's a waste of his. That's that leaves him with four mana, which doesn't leave him much to do much. Oh, he's still gonna go face? He's gonna bomber again? There's another bomber. Oh, there's Infernal. Yeah, should have played around that. Yeah, okay. But it's fine, I have this. I have Aldor Peacekeeper, which would kind of screws up his play, so. And then I'm gonna Acolyte Pain and not hit, so we'll pass here. I should have I should have met noticed that it's six monitor and I think I'm dead infernal. 
But I still got rid of everything on his board as well, so that that's okay by me. And now I can draw cards from the Dread Inferno. Okay, that's fine. I can cog hammer. I can hit and cog hammer. Okay, okay. So that's a six seven. I have seven damage on I have seven damage to deal with that, which I can, but let's draw. Okay, Imp Master. Now, do I want to kill this and then play the Kraken Consort? And then play the Fairy Dragon? Or I could play the Fairy Dragon and then the Dragon Consort so that this still deals with the. Um, so that this does it automatically on Onyxia. Now, this would leave me. Uh, you know what? I'm gonna do it anyway. I think it's the right idea. Let's go ahead and do it. I don't think I can do 11 damage to my face, and I do have a Voodoo Doctor and a Guided of Kings to heal me. And I'm gonna keep drawing cards with this, so... I like this play, it might be a misplay if he has something. Next turn I can Cog Hammer or play Force Tank. We'll see. Okay, Yeti, that trades into that. Taste! I love this card. Whoever voiced this is amazing. I love who voiced this card. It is so cool. Oh, I can Aldor Peacekeeper that and then trade. Oh, that would be so good. But first, let's, let's, let's draw. Okay, so I can Abusive. Okay, so I can Abusive Sergeant this and kill it. Then kill that and then I can Force Tank. What would, would I want to do that? That's still left with 3-1, which you can... Um, what is the stronger play? Probably this, and that plays also. No, it doesn't play around in C tech. I could. Uh, okay, so I can either force tank. I can't do both, so I can't do this into force tank. I think the best idea here is to probably Aldor Peacekeeper. This. Hit it. Hit that. And then play the Imp Master. And hero power, because why not? I could have aggressed harder and went with the force tank, but he might have a siphon soul or something that might kill it. Hmm. I mean, it's debatable whether this was the right play or not. I do have a cr bunch of crap on the board now. I'm probably gonna go face again. Or kill that, yeah, that made I did it. Then I'll hit, hit it. Oh, that is awkward. Toshley, okay, that's not the worst that could have happened, but it does suck. But so now I'm gonna have to call camera. Oh, that's good. I can this and the call camera. Okay, so hit, hit definitely. Now, do I want? Do, wait, I can kill that. Give a minion plus two attack. Wait, did I play that too quickly? No, that's fine. Um, so I could plus two attack. That's five. Se that's a and it hits it, and that add a spare part to your hand. Okay, that's fine. I can kill, I can deal with that, and then I can force tank. So I think that's what I'm gonna do. So I'm gonna um, abuse the sergeant. Hopefully it hit that. Yes, it did. Then force tank, and then hit him in the face. Oh, that's my bad, I just hit my mic. Whoops. Then next turn, I'll just cog hammer. I think double power overwhelming might kill me. We'll see. Let's have a taunt, let's have a heal. Let's have a huge minion. We're, we're, we're in a good shape. Our health is kind of low. Oh, I wish a Guardian of Kings would show up. I have 1 in 13 chance of doing that, which are pretty low. I wonder. Let's see. I'm going to Coke Hammer next turn for sure. I, I think I'm going to dump my hand next turn. Wait, he tapped. Okay. Let's see. What is he doing? Oh god, it happened again. Stupid DX story stopped recording. I have to find what the problem is with that. So basically I think what you missed was that he played um 
an antique heal bot, he g and he gave it a, sh a shield, I mean a stealth, and then I traded something to something. I and then he played the loot hoarder. No, that's that's I played also Repentance, I played Avenge, and I played the uh, Lord of the Ring, which I drew, which is fine. Is that, okay, now Avenge. Hopefully to okay, that's fine. That's an okay place to go because this is gonna go into that. So I have a bunch of damage on the board, and I'm gonna call camera next turn. Was he gonna go face? He was gonna go face. But I can kill that with this. Wait. Se do, wait, I have lethal, I think, right? Do I have lethal? Yes, I have lethal. Yeah, okay, so we win. Okay, cool. Well played. So now we're four now. Oh, we're five and oh. Jesus, I can't keep track. Okay, so I'm gonna end off the part here. If again, if you have any tips, give me any misplays I did, especially in the, my last one. I have to go through that. And yeah, thank you. Leave a like, leave a comment if you enjoyed, and hopefully I'll see you guys in the next part. Bye, guys.